Hey everybody, this is Brett and today I'm extremely excited to show you this brand new 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer. This is basically a Series 2 package with the Obsidian Group on it. It also has the Convenience Group, the Heavy Duty Towing Group, and the Rear Seat Entertainment Group. We're going to go all the way around on this vehicle, inside, out. We're shooting this video in 4K today. So um, it's going to be a pretty long video because there's a lot of stuff to go over on this vehicle. First off, we'll start with all the specs. This one has the 6.4 liter V8 overhead valve Hemi engine. It has cylinder deactivation on it, 471 horsepower, 455 foot-pounds of torque. It's going to get you 18 miles per gallon on the highway, 13 city for an average of 15 miles per gallon. This one is in Baltic Gray Metallic, which the paint code is PAS, if you were curious. And uh, we're just gonna go all the way around, check out all the options, all the new stuff on it, go over this beautiful interior on this vehicle, and just give you a really good idea of what this vehicle is all about. First off, this one comes with the 22 inch Kind of a granite crystal painted with the black inserts on it and it's going to go, come with the Goodyear Eagle Touring tires. These are 285 45R22s, kind of an all-terrain tread pattern to them. And uh, we're going to check out the original window sticker just so you can see all the options before we really get in um, depth with this walk around. I'm not going to go over everything but uh, kind of everything. Uh, base price is $97,995. You can see that it is a Series 2 4x4 Baltic gray metallic global black interior. Has the Palermo leather trimmed seats with massage, 6.4 V8 engine, eight speed automatic transmission. And everything you see on the left there is your standard equipment. Lots of safety features standard on this vehicle. And then your optional equipment starts with the Baltic Gray Clear Coat Exterior Paint, which is $645. This one is the Customer Preferred Package 23T, which is $5,495. And that includes the Obsidian Appearance Package, ventilated rear seats, foldable cargo shade, premium color tinted glass, piano black exterior accents, adjustable roof rail crossbars, black clear coat exterior paint, Macintosh MX 1375 reference entertainment system with 23 speakers, front passenger interactive display, 22 inch um, tinted polished wheels with black inserts, front console cooler, black interior accents, black roof, and bl gloss black daylight opening moldings. Convenience group is $37.95, which gives you advanced security alert system, night vision with pedestrian and animal detection, rear seat monitoring camera with, or the fam cam and active driving assist system Intersex, intersection collision assist system also has the heavy duty trailer tow package which is 995 trail brake controller the trailer hitch lineup assist trailer hitch zoom removable rear tow hook black tow hooks and heavy duty engine cooling and the rear seat entertainment group which is 2195 gives you the amazon fire tv built in and the 10.1 inch rear entertainment screens. Total MSRP on this vehicle is $113,120. And this is the most expensive vehicle I've ever videoed um, professionally at our dealership. So it's exciting there. Three year 36 bumper to bumper and five year 60 powertrain warranty. Your Fuel economy is right there, 18 highway, 13 city for an average of 15, and has not been rated for government five-star crash test ratings quite yet. So that is the original window sticker. You can see it does have the nice big power folding step bars. They fold up nicely, four-wheel disc brakes on this vehicle, and you can see the Obsidian package gives you all this gloss black roof rails and everything. Also notice around the windows is all gloss black as well. You get the trim on the mirrors, which is gloss black too. 
and there is a Wagoneer on the windshield if you're looking for Easter eggs. I didn't find a lot of them, but that is one of them. Coming around to the back, I do have the hitch cover off of this just so that you can see the towing package. You get the receiver hitch, the four pin wiring, seven pin wiring right there. Um, and that hitch cover goes flush over that. You have the backup parking sensors. Um, I think this is really cool. They have, it's kind of like a honeycomb design there. It's got a little bit of metal flake to it. Um, it just kind of looks really cool on the back there. You get the Grand Wagoneer all in black with the chrome accents on it. The LED tail lamps. And uh, we'll take a quick look at the back seats here, or the back storage area. This is, of course, a power rear gate. And there is your receiver hitch cover. This is your front license plate. These are the window shades that come with the vehicle. And under this really nice floor mat is your crossbars for the roof rails, and then a cargo net, and then an audio kit dual channel. I'm not sure exactly what these are in here but it's all taped up so i'm not going to open it and then these seats do fold down they are powerful and that second you can see when the second row is back too far that it'll actually just come right back up and then to get those back up like so back here you get a 12 volt power point couple of tie downs for that cargo net you get that subwoofer part of the Macintosh um, premium audio group press that it'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent actually beeps at you a total of four times you get the quadra drive logo there all blacked out as well Baltic gray metallic has a lot of metal flake to it I can get it to zoom here just right it's better when it's not on the lights or picture studio. You can see it has a lot of metal flake to it. It's really a cool looking color. You do get the capless fuel fill, which is really nice. Never get fuel on your hands. And it does take, this one does take premium fuel only. You get the Grand Wagoneer lettering on the side along with the American flag looks really good. Notice how nice and smooth those power step bars come out. Inside you get the global black interior with the Palermo leather seats. The light gray piping. These are massaging seats. And if you ever want to know what trim level you have, they always put it on the back of the seat, so this is a Series 2. Get the premium floor mats, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. You get the gloss black interior trim up here and here. Um, your massage controls are right here as well as your uh, power seats. You can fold these mirrors in. You have to turn that down, and then they will fold in automatically. And then when you just turn it back to up, they'll go out. So that's how that works. Really a cool design trim on these doors. This one has the ambient lighting, which lights up underneath the uh, doors here, which I'll show you in just a second. You can see it on the dash here, which is really cool. And then we'll hop inside and take a look at everything that this vehicle has to offer on the interior, because it's quite a lot. So you get the big display right here. This is all digital, digital speedometer. Um, and you can do all your different settings here. Um, you can put a nav screen up, your miles per gallon, the radio, your ride height. So this has the quadra lift system where you, it raises and lowers the vehicle or the air suspension, if you will. Um, just a really cool instrument cluster. You get the flat bottom steering wheel, the Grand Wagoneer logo on the steering wheel information and Bluetooth controls on the left. This is the button that helps you get to that five display screen there. 
leather wrapped. I'm sure it's heated as well. Adaptive cruise controls, uh, regular cruise controls. And then this is active driving assist and lane detection. Um, that button right there, you get that really cool. There's actually a little bit of texture to that material. Um, so it's not just for looks, it's, it's actually textured. It's textured. Then your gear selector right there has the push button start. This is the Uconnect um, 5 radio with the big touchscreen display. You also get displays down here. Uh, so this thing has a lot of screens in it. I think I counted seven screens with the instrument cluster. This one, this one, that's three. There's one on the passenger side as well. That's four. And then there's three in the back. So seven screens in this vehicle. It's pretty crazy. And if you consider the um, video camera that's in the rear view mirror, then it's eight. So really a cool system. This one has the suede headliner, the power sunroof with second row um, panel glass. And uh, let's just get to this radio here because this is some really cool stuff. Of course, it's going to have the navigation system on it. Um, and you can see that comes up nicely. You have your home screen, your radios, AM, FM, serious capabilities. You have your different media that you can do here. Um, AM, FM, your phone with Bluetooth. And then you have your comfort controls, obviously, for your heated and cooled seats. And then you can do your massage seats down here. And if you wanted this up, you just press that button and this folds open like so. That is your wireless cell phone charge pad. You get three USBs, two or three USBs, three USB C's, an AUX jack, and an HDMI um, plug in for the passengers. So, whatever they're doing on that screen, you can plug in an HDMI device and it can display up there. So really, really a lot of amazing stuff that goes with this vehicle. Uh, you have your phone controls here. And uh, you have the fam cam. You have your different vehicle displays right here. The fam, cram fam cam, the surround view camera. So you can see all the way around 360. Your rear view, you get a wide view, wide view front, narrow view front, and then your backup camera and then you can zoom on that receiver hitch that's part of that uh, towing package the heavy duty towing package and you have your passenger screen you can turn that on you can turn it off um, you can put the second row it's very touchy so it has the off-road pages here different controls you can turn the power side steps off and then you have all your different apps um, if you go to all it'll bring them all up android auto apple carplay you can do those all wirelessly your massage seats your mirror dimmer nav of course you have the relax system which is pretty crazy um, and i'll show you the one other easter egg that i found so when you have this on it has these like relaxing ambient noise um features on here you can change all of these and the other easter egg i found is on here and if you look real closely right there it says 1963 which is when the original grand wagoneer came out so that's the uh, other easter egg i found on this vehicle but you can do fireplace, the Aurora, which is which we did just have on the forest, which is kind of cool. And then you topographic. I like this one. So a lot of cool stuff that you can do with that. Um, and like I said, all the other apps on here. Um, I wanted to get to that off-road pages there. So you have your steering angle, which you can see as I turn the steering wheel, that changes. Uh, you have your transfer case, rear axle locker, accessory gauges, pitch and roll, select terrain, uh, your suspension for the ride height and everything, latitude, longitude, altitude, 
just an amazing amount of stuff that you can do with this vehicle. And then down here, your other controls, your eight speed automatic transmission, lane departure, stability control, auto hold on, I'm guessing that's for your electronic parking brake, uh, your hazard lights, your uh, driving assistance, I would assume that that's what that is, parking sensors, tow haul, and then uh, trailer backup assist, I'm guessing. Uh, but anyways, you have that. You can close this. You have your Quadratrack 2 system with the Sport, Auto, Snow, Sand, Mud, Rock. You have your lift system or the um, air suspension system you can raise and lower. You have your terrain, uh, select speed, control, four-wheel drive, low, and a neutral setting for flat towing. You have the nice uh, P-Fob here with remote start. It says Grand Wagoneer on the back of it. Get cup holders right here, and everything is in that like textured metal design. And underneath here is your refrigerated glove box. So that's when you turn that on, it'll start pumping cold air into there. That seems like it seals nicely. You get the leather wrapped dash, the Macintosh tweeters up there and uh, the other thing I wanted to show you was the ambient light color light so you can choose your different colors and then that changes on the doors as well as underneath the dash there and obviously when it's darker out um, you'd notice those better but you can change the bottom lights and the top lights to uh, be different colors so if you want the bottom ones yellow and these dark blue you could do that or make them both yellow or red and yellow, kind of customize it however you want to do it. So a lot of really cool stuff. I can say these massaging seats are amazing. We'll take a quick look at the back seats because that is the other huge thing on this vehicle. This one has the second row quad seating. These uh, back seats are heated and cooled. You get the fire TVs. Part of that rear seat entertainment system and they work just like you know if you have a nav or if you have a internet on your phone or like a hotspot or something these can work exactly like your fire tv at home you get two usbs two usb c's back here 115 volt 150 watt plug-in 12 volt power point here's that rear screen which controls your heated and cooled seats as well as your rear air controls and now the biggest thing with the Wagoneer and the Grand Wagoneer is the third row uh, seats. So very, very roomy back here. And the thing I love most about the Wagoneer and Grand Wagoneer is the fact that I can sit comfortably back here and I can also come into the vehicle and get out of the vehicle very easily. You can see there's a lot of space to get through from that second row seat and uh, it's really easy to get back here and those step bars and I tell this to everybody those step bars are nice and wide so when you get out of the vehicle it's very easy to get out you get your uh, seat control you can lean this seat back put it forward that you're sitting in a USB USB-C same thing on the other side and uh, this might help you see that seat go back better So that's pretty cool too. And then you get the third row fixed glass roof up back here. See that goes like so. And there's your fam cam. And uh, yeah, just a really neat vehicle. We're gonna do a final walk around, but check this out. So when I get out of the vehicle, it's really easy for me to step on this step bar because it's nice and wide. I'm not gonna slip off or anything. These seats go back like so, and then you can actually adjust them as well. Uh, second row also has a nice big storage area. And you get these sunshades on the back as well, which are really nice. Child safety locks, of course, on the back doors. 
and I'll do a final walk around with all the lights on here. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and uh, if you liked the video and it was helpful, uh, give us a like, subscribe and share on our YouTube channel which is youtube.com slash summit auto. And once again, thank you so much for checking out the video. You got all those LED fog lamps, headlights and running lights on this vehicle. Notice all the gloss black on the surrounds and grill. Um, really a good looking vehicle and uh, definitely really excited to be selling these and uh, proud to be selling these because they are so well made and just really good looking and so much technology and things to offer on this vehicle. Thanks again for checking out the video and to see more pictures of this vehicle or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And uh, if you'd like to see more videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications and you'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day here at Summit Auto. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wagoneer and Grand Wagoneer videos like this one in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering this 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer Series 2 Obsidian Package in Baltic Gray Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share.